Welcome to another Varnberg Implement product informational series video. And today we're here with the Massey Ferguson 1740E tractor. This is uh, the first sinkler shuttle version we had. This is a manual shuttle with a gear transmission versus a hydrostat version. We've done a previous video on the hydrostat version. Today we're going to showcase the sinker shuttle transmission option. One thing that a sinker shuttle provides over a hydrostat is more PTO horsepower. The 1740E comes in at 38 and a half engine horsepower and 32.7 on the PTO. Uh, a, a hydrostat is not as efficient as a gear drive transmission so that provides you more allows more engine horsepower to be converted into PTO horsepower and PTO horsepower is what it takes to operate your implements like rotary cutters finish mowers and tillers we're gonna jump in here discuss the features the operations and how to drive and use this tractor and how you get the most out of it um, this tractor for example on the PTO or on the three-point hitch arms can lift 2,205 pounds at the hitch point. Two foot behind that is another measurement and you're going to, to see a lot of manufacturers use. That rating is 1,600 pounds when it's two foot behind. So 1,600 pounds is more a true measurement but if you're lifting at this point here it can lift up to 2,205 pounds. Our hydraulic remotes, which power our loaders, we have 7.2 gallons per minute to the flow to the loader, or if you add optional rear remotes, which they can be installed here up to two sets. It has a total system hydraulic pressure or hydraulic volume of 11.3 gallons per minute. One of the great things of, of, of Massey Ferguson's besides our steel hoods and our steel fenders that everybody has come to know is the ease of operation and mate. Just pull this lever and the pop-up hood, automotive style pop-up hood pops open so you can get access to the the tractor. Maintenance is easy. The battery's right up here in front. The coolant overflow tank. Got your low high marks. You can quickly easily identify that. Your air cleaner is easy to take care of got a clean out screen and it is metal and it'll slide out to keep the dirt and the chaff out of your radiators um, coming around from that here on the right hand side of the engine is our oil dipstick right here easy to pull out and maintain your engine oil filter is right here fuel filter oil fill is all simple and easy here on the right hand side of the the tractor. This tractor does feature a diesel particulate filter. This one is an automatic system based on time. Typically every four to five hours it's going to automatically do a regeneration. Just keep using it. Don't listen to the competition that tells you you got to park these things. The best thing you can do on a diesel particulate filter on a Massey Ferguson when the light comes on in the dash it's going to be a yellow light is continue to use it keep your RPMs up and let it do its thing. It's just like a self-cleaning oven in many houses. Uh, got a turbocharger here on the left hand side. This does feature the 1.5 liter Shibaru diesel engine. The 1740 is upgrade of our 1739 model with our new hood styling and grill. It's got the uh, global style hood uh, our features of the new Massey Ferguson 1700E series. This tractor base weight with no loader, you're looking at 2,800 or yeah, 2,877 pounds. Uh, it's fitted with the FLX 2407 loader. We've got it here with the optional skid steer quick attach. We pretty much order all of our loaders on. Bucket gauge rod is standard equipment. Optional is third func solenoid third function control available from Massey Ferguson. This tractor will lift 
1450 pounds at the pivot pin to a lift height of 94 inches and we'll fire this tractor up and show you just how high it lifts uh, got a heavy duty bucket got drilled cutting edge uh, got the skid steer quick attach style it's a nice beefy heavy lift loader easy to take on easy to take off flip the stands down pull the loader pins right back here and unplug the hydraulics over here on your joystick and you can have the loader off and out of the way one of the biggest things that features that customers constantly tell us about that they love is our ground level fueling this features a 10 gallon fuel tank it is divided on two halves on both sides it's got a bevel gear pinion front axle that gives you a lot of high arch and a great turning radius you can see there and you can see how high clearance that is so you can work in those rough conditions got foldable ROPS standard equipment toolbox back here top link is is standard we've just got it inside already adjust seat base adjustment on your springs is right here this is your hydraulic fill is here with a sight glass right down here that you can see quickly see the sight level you got the stabilizers here the screwed style jack style stabilizers um, great economical basic tractor to make it to do your work and get work done faster a gear drive transmission uh, with a synchronized forward reverse mechanical shuttle that requires a clutch to use it and we'll show you as we jump on here and take it for a ride there's the other fuel tank on this side but just go over some of the controls this is going to be your three-point control raise and lower on the right hand side this tractor features independent PTO so you do not have to clutch it does not have a two-stage clutch it is independent of the transmission on the synchro shuttle version it has dual brakes with a park brake position you have left and right hand brakes and you can actually separate them I've got pressure on it right now but uh, for individual braking on the synchro shuttle and you have a foot throttle and you have differential lock on the heel back here come under the seat we have our flow control that allows you to control the how fast the three-point hitch falls or you can even lock it our four-wheel drive engagement you push down to engage pull up to disengage your one first second and third and fourth gear shift lever third and fourth are synchronized mechanical throttle your loader joystick and it does have a lock position so if you're using the tractor with the without and not need the loader you can lock this to prevent accidentally dropping the loader in the ground while you're running up and down the, the fields or in the road probably one of the most talked about features also is the cup holder everybody's got to have a cup on the left hand side you have a high range and a low range this needs to be come to a complete stop clutch the pedal before you shift the shift the range come down here we have our hazard lights our left signal our right signal and our high beam low beam headlights and then the sinker shuttle a clutchable shuttle you push the clutch and you can shift from forward neutral and reverse and this can be done on the go and we'll show you how that's done we're getting ready to hop up here fire this bad boy up take her for a ride show you the features of it got fuses right that panel right down here it's a very simple basic tractor but it's got a lot of neat features get a lot of dollar got a lot a lot of features for the dollars without breaking the bank 15 by 19.5 uh, r4 rear tires is the ones we've got featured on here this is a really neat swoop design that offers mud clean out but it also gives a very good ride on hard surfaces as you got more lug contact to the ground same way on the front we'll jump up here got the nice high back comfy seat you can have a clutch pedal and we'll jump down here you turn your key on and as the, you'll see the preheat light 
typically when it's warm it'll come over start the tractor and come back once it does that turn the key and it is ready to go the first thing we need to do is shift in we'll shift to low range we'll shift over here we'll shift to first gear forward raise the loader hit our parking brake and we're going and that is first gear you want to go reverse push clutch reverse clutch forward now if you want to change speeds second gear come to push the clutch come to a stop come to third gear and remember third and fourth has a synchronizer so you can hit them on the go and this is all low range and you got to for every forward speed you have a reverse speed now if you want to go to the higher range you need to stop clutch stop clutch put it in range and now we're going forward in high range and you do have the sinker shuttle in the reverse come go to second gear and you can clutch on the move while it's rolling as you can see we're doing come to a stop come over to third gear and remember third and fourth are synchronized so we can shift that one on the go and now you're in eighth gear forward speed you got the loader good tight turning radius we'll go down here we just got this 1740e sinker shuttle in we also got a hydro in right there um, Inventory's trickling in, but we're selling fast as can be. We had two leave today, but there's a 1740 in the hydro version. We'll just jump over there and show you the difference. And I hit the lever. The biggest difference is your is going to be your gear shift lever, your shuttle lever, and your control deck here. You got a clutch, you have a single brake and your treadle pedal hydrostat and you have three ranges for your hydrostat. This is the 1740E and the hydro. We did a video on it, so if you're interested in the hydro, go watch that video. If you're interested in a synchro shuttle, this will save you a little money, give you a little more PTO horsepower if you need need it for a heavier duty cutter, bigger tiller, those type of implements at 32.7 that is the big difference between the sinker shuttle and the hydrostat and hit the brakes or it won't let you go you got a foot throttle you can run it manual throttle see the loader coming up you can do two functions at once doing the two functions at once there down and curl got good loader speed you have float position you do have float position with this loader you can push the lever forward and you can still adjust bucket angle and one of the great things is for like back dragging you can 
to follow the ground contours, especially if you're coming up a slight incline like getting snow. Float is an excellent option to use with your loader. That's pretty much the 1700 E series with the synchro shuttle transmission. This is the new 40 that uh, is available, the 1740. Check out that lift height on that FL2407 loader. You're 94 inches to that pivot pin from the ground. Got a deep, a good deep roll or dump angle. Uh, got a good rollback angle. These are tapered edge buckets that allow, once the material moves, it falls out. Uh, drilled cutting edge, heavy duty loader, heavy, heavy duty tractors. Built to last, metal hoods, metal fenders, ground level fueling, the features you need at the price you can afford. Come check out Massey Ferguson and visit your local dealer. If you're in West Central Missouri, come visit us at Varnberg Implement. We're your West Central Missouri Massey Ferguson and Rhino Ag dealer here in Higginsville, Missouri. Bone set is waving high at you over there at our fall display here. Uh, we got Fall and Massey and Fergie uh, hanging out on the GC series. Um, we got Rhino Ag Cutters. We're getting a little inventory back in, but inventory is going to be short for the remainder of 2020. Um, we've, we've already heard it. Uh, sales have been outstanding this year, and we're getting some inventory in, but it's going to be trickling through the end of the year it's going to be a challenge we're working our tails off to work with other dealers to help you find the inventory you need we've got everything from 6700 4700 series we got some hay tools left and they got some extra discounts through the end of uh, right now to clean out this year but we're get the M series premium tractors we got a 2605 we've got some 1700 E series Get to your Massey Ferguson dealer, and if you're in West Central Missouri or Kansas City area, just come out Interstate 70 to exit 49, four miles north to that stoplight. That's the Highway 13 and Business 13, and that is the corner of Varnberg Implement, Tractor World. We're going to show you, teach you, and help you get the most out of your hard-earned dollars. Come visit us at Varnberg Implement and come see the new 1740E synchro shuttle transmission at Varnberg Implement today. You better hurry because I've already got a couple guys today that are interested in looking at this tractor. So tractors ain't lasting very long. We're seeing some, some don't even make it off the truck. So get to your Massey Ferguson dealer. There's a reason why we're selling fast because you get a lot of features for your dollar. Get more, do more, just get you a Massey Ferguson. With customer support around the world, sold in over 190 different countries, parts distribution, mechanics that are fully trained and ready to serve your needs. Get more, get you a Massey Ferguson, and get it in Varnberg Implement if you're in West Central Missouri. <laughs>